Hi, welcome to my bathroom. I have had long hair before um, and it looked pretty good, but honestly, I was in college. You know, I was too focused on other things like drinking and getting good grades and things. But now I have a personal vendetta against my hair touching my neck and my shoulders for whatever reason. Once it gets to about this length, I no longer like the length. So I just want my hair shorter. Now I know that 99.9% .9 of people go to the hair salon to get their hair done. As you can see, I have curly hair and I don't personally trust anybody else to do my hair. I have been to the salon, but it was years ago. She cut it way too short when I went. She had cut it like, she cut it like here, like it was way too short. So I'm gonna go ahead and cut my hair. I do have hair cutting scissors, where I did. Um, okay, I found them, sorry. I don't know why that took me so long to freaking find those things, but anyway. I have materials, so again, like I said, I usually cut my hair because I don't really trust anybody else to do it. I just realized I was out of frame, sorry. Um, so, I am going to try my best. Again, I have done this before, so it's not like it's the first time I'm ever doing this, but just trying to find more of these clips so I can like clip my hair back so I can like do this semi quickly. You know what, honestly, we're not gonna find it, so whatever. Okay. What I normally do here is like, so I kind of want, there's a mirror in front of me. I kind of want it like here, I think. So maybe like an inch off, is that an inch? It's about an inch. Okay, so I usually just start with like a piece here and just like go for it. So I cut, like there's a specific way when you're cutting hair to do it. Like curly hair, it's like these things, like it's between this piece. You know what, I should probably, should probably get a trash can so I don't make a mess. Hold on one second. Let's go ahead and get started here. So I'm curious, who else cuts their hair at home? Who else is like me? and doesn't trust hairstylists. I'm sure you guys are fantastic, but it's just, it's not the way that I vibe, that's all. I just, I don't know. Whenever I go to a hairstylist or a salon, I ask them to cut my hair dry. You So basically, for those of you who don't know, like if you cut curly hair, um, the way that, like if you wet it down, it, like weighs it down. So then when you cut it, it's shorter than when you, like when it dries, it's shorter than when you cut it. Just, like I asked her to cut it dry, or yeah, to cut it dry. And she like kind of wet it in just enough to where um, it was clearly, mm -hmm. it was too wet. So when she cut it, like it was here dry, but when it, or here wet, but when it dried, it like shrunk. That's that's the word I'm looking for, it shrunk. Basically, I'm just, oh my God. Now that Amy is gonna follow this tutorial, <laughs> tutorial, I just called this video a tutorial. It's not this tutorial. Um, but if anybody is gonna follow this, or if you want to like know how to deal with curly hair, I got all of my insight from the book Curly Girl. And that helped me tremendously, especially since I was not born with curly hair. It happened after puberty. So I had to learn how to um, like deal with it. So when it starts getting like to the back parts, like this is when it starts to get confusing because I'm only, I'm not, I know clip thing right here to minimize confusion so all the ones that i've cut already go into the clip and then that way i know where i have and have not been which i find helpful until you get to here and then you're like wait what all right that one's been cut cool cool cool, cool. okay let me twist this the other fun part about cutting curly hair is that if you fuck it up nobody notices because 
It's not like it's obvious. Did I cut that piece? No, okay. Because if you cut it and it's like, and there's like a chunk that's like an inch shorter than the rest, nobody notices because again, it's curly. Awesome. Oh, that's short. Oh, uh oh. Oh no. That might be a problem. I don't think I explained in the beginning what I'm trying to do here. My goal for how I want my hair to like lay after this is kind of like a long bob, but I've previously cut it in a way that I like, which is why I'm just going in and just cutting individual pieces. But I've previously cut it in a way that I like, which is why I'm just going in and just cutting individual pieces. Because if I obviously didn't like the way that my hair was cut, like if I wanted it in a slightly different style, like if I wanted it all like the same level or something like that, I would cut it in a chunk in that in that sense. Because I already have like the hair style, quote unquote, that I want, I'm just going in piece by piece. So if anybody had that question, there you go. There's your answer. Because I already have like the hair style, quote unquote, that I want, I'm just going in piece by piece, so if anybody had that question, there you go. There's your answer. Also, I don't know if this is the proper way to cut. I'm not a hairstylist by any means. Just take that for what it is. The good news is also it's getting into the trash can, so I'm not making a giant mess. All right, so we're getting closer to the middle here. This is getting hard to see. Okay, so I'm going, oh, I think one piece that's already been cut, cut in there. Okay, so I'm going to just tie this off here, just so I don't get confused with which part I did and which part I didn't. Because the clip is like, it's cool and all, but like sometimes it doesn't help. Okay, that part I don't, I didn't, did I cut that? Have you been cut? Tell me, have you been cut? I already had trouble putting my hair in a ponytail before this, so this is just gonna be even worse. Do I care? No. That is very short, that is not even at all. Cool. <laughs> oh no. See, sometimes when you cut your own hair, you, you do little minor mess ups there. And that's okay, you know why? Because I wear my hair curly, so nobody's gonna know. Well, except for everybody watching this video, but nobody's gonna know otherwise. It's fine. And no, to everybody asking, I am okay. I'm not having a midlife crisis. I just wanted my hair cut. That's all. Just thought that my hair needed a little trim. That is all. Just a little trim. Well, also because I'm gonna dye my hair in a later video and I want this to be nice and fresh for the hair dye. Hell yeah. I'm getting to the back here and this is where it gets a little tricky, mainly because I can't freaking see anything. <laughs> but, okay, so let's just, we're gonna chop. See this big chunk right here? Like, I don't, that's a ringlet. I don't know if you can see that. That's a ringlet. Um, but I cannot figure out where it starts and ends. So we're just gonna let's see if I can kind of separate this out a little bit here. The struggle is real. And I realized that I could just have avoided this whole, oh, you see that? She's dangling. I realized I could have avoided that struggle. There it is. Um, if I would have just gone to the hair salon and just paid for them to cut my hair, but you know what? No, I'm gonna do it myself because I'm a grown adult. I'm a strong, independent woman and I can cut my own hair, darn it. Okay. I like little bits and pieces here. Okay, I can't really tell if that's like all cut or not. That piece is not cut. And for those pieces that I can't see, like the curl, I'm just cutting. It's hair, it'll grow back if I cut it wrong, right? 
cool. You see how short this side is though? Compared to this side. <laughs> see that? <laughs> it's gonna be short. I don't care though, honestly. I like it better like that. Can you tell in the back? I don't know, probably. <laughs> anyway, um, let's see. Like I said, it's getting hard to see where the pieces that have been cut are versus the pieces that have not been cut. That has been cut. This. Sure, we'll snip it, why not? Okay. And I know you're probably like, how the hell are you seeing if it's cut or not? Honestly, I've been doing this enough times to myself that I can tell, but I know that not everybody is going to be able to tell, so that's okay though. Okay, I need help for the back. Hold on, be right back. Okay, so I have the back done. I elicited help from my boyfriend, but he doesn't want to be on camera, so he came in fixed it and then he left and so camera's back on um anyway so he got the rest of the back because his left side is done back is done so now it's time to tackle all of this so let's get to it so i'm just gonna go ahead and hop on in here oh, i just pulled my hair trying to do that that was uncomfy. It was very uncomfy. Um, I wonder if going from front to back might help. So here, let me take this out. Ow. Okay. Sexy. Oh yeah, you can already, oh boy. Yeah, you can already see it's shorter. I think I might, Ooh, is that not? This guy managed to get by without being cut. How? How did you do that, sir? Let me know your ways. Okay. Are you cut? You have been cut, yes. Okay. So yeah, you can see that this side is already a little bit shorter than this side. And it has straightened out just a little bit because it was in the ponytail, so it'll be a little bit shorter whenever it's done as well. On to the side, so we'll just start in the front. I keep moving too far into the frame, sorry. Okay, we'll chubby chubby here. So we're kind of maxing out on, ooh. we're maxing out on the amount of hair that can fit in this clip and this clip. So I'm gonna use another clip. This honestly is a hairstyle. <laughs> this is the way to get it, men, okay? All right, we're on clip number three. So, the wine clip, well, three, number four clip. I can't do math. Also, I think this is a hairstyle. What do you think? Um, yeah, no, we're, we're moving on to four clips um, because I have so much hair that I need a fourth one. So, fourth clip. But we are almost done. We are in the home stretch. I only have this section of hair left. So I only have like from like this. This is it. Like this is the last chunk. So we're almost there. Quickly this time. Um, and it hasn't really taken that long, also because like I have plans after this that I gotta do. So <laughs> I 
Um, but oh, oh, I'm missing. Clips save lives. This hair is so much longer than the rest of them, though. Did I miss that one? I think I did. How did I miss you? I'll just cut a smidge. I think that looks pretty even, no? How's it look in the back? Does it look pretty bad in the back, or does it look pretty good in the back? It feels good to me. A common problem with curly hair is triangle hair. If you don't know what that is, it basically means that like your hair goes like this, which is pretty much what it's doing right now. So to avoid that, I'm just going to add in some layers. <music> There's hair everywhere. There's literally, I'm gonna have to bring out the vacuum because there's hair like everywhere. I tried my best, but you know. Wet it, style it, and I will come back. So like, yeah, let me style it and then I'll come back with the finished look and then I'll show you the mess that I made. <laughs> Before I show you the big reveal, I just want to show you like this is the mess that I made so it's really not that bad a little bit there a little bit here and then there's like that's from like what my boyfriend uh did when he helped so like not that bad it's, it's still a little wet obviously but um it has styling stuff in it so this is closer to what it would look like I don't know what do you think I think it looks hot I like it a lot how do you think I think the back look is pretty like pretty even. It kind of has that uh, like that side swipe like that I was talking about that I wanted, you know, where it goes up like that for this week. So always like, comment, subscribe. I try and post new videos every Friday. Um, and I'll see you guys next week.